Roman Catholicism teaches that the redemption Jesus Christ purchased by his death on the cross was delivered to the Catholic Church to be distributed to men through the sacraments. The New Parish Catechism on page 52 says, The Church gives grace to the people through the sacraments. The Catholic Church makes us share in God's life through baptism and feeds us with the body and blood of Christ in Holy Communion. We receive the grace of Christian maturity in the sacrament of confirmation, and our sins are forgiven through confession. According to the Catholic Church, salvation is a process that begins at baptism and is kept alive through the sacraments. If the Catholic has faith in Jesus Christ and participates in the sacraments, they will be saved. Many non-Catholic churches have adopted similar progressive views of salvation. Trinity Fellowship, a non-denominational megachurch in Amarillo, Texas, posted this definition of salvation on their website. Salvation is not a one-time event that saves us from hell. It is a lifestyle of loving, obeying, serving, and becoming more like Christ who saved us. Progressive salvation is not a Bible doctrine. Salvation is instant and complete at the moment a sinner places his trust in the Lord Jesus Christ. Paul explains this in Ephesians 1.13 In whom ye also trusted, after that ye heard the word of truth, the gospel of your salvation, in whom also after that ye believed, ye were sealed with that Holy Spirit of promise. The sinner hears the gospel, trust in Christ and is sealed by the Holy Spirit. Paul goes on to say in Colossians 2.11 Ye are circumcised with the circumcision made without hands, in the putting off of the body of the sins of the flesh by the circumcision of Christ. At the moment of salvation the believer is spiritually separated or cut away from his flesh so that sin can no longer separate him from God. Romans 8.23 says that we are waiting for the redemption of our body. It is our body that is still subject to sin and death. Spiritually, we have experienced the new birth and have entered into Christ's rest. Hebrews 4.10 says, For he that is entered into his rest, he hath also ceased from his own works, as God did from his. The spiritual maturity of the believer is progressive, not the redemption that saves us from God's wrath. Progressive salvation is a tool of Satan used to keep man from resting in the completed, redemptive work of the Lord Jesus Christ.